So yes, happy Mother's Day guys. If a mom say <laughs> happy Mother's Day guys. Today is Mother's Day Sunday and we are off to church. We're off to church guys. I don't know. I think we are late safe but anywho I had to make up. I had to do everything to look peng. So we are off to church now guys and I'll take you guys along to church. Now we don't have to use cab, we don't have to use the bus, we don't have to trek. We are going to drive. Oh my god, I'm so excited. <laughs> Super, super super excited church was amazing church was good like it was really 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 fun there was no preaching um i i i'll I insert few clips where they call women out there for panel it was it was really good happy mother's day to every mother out there happy mother's day to me um you rock you're amazing you're doing a good job you're seen you are loved being a mother is, is an incredible difficult job that people that you don't get paid for no one ever gets paid for being a mother so it's 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 amazing what we do i pray that god continues to new bestow upon you strength to continue taking care of your own taking care of your children and raise good and godly children right um so today we just finished church we're going back home and we have to go to aldi Thank God. Thank God. Don't miss about the talk. We have to get to Aldi. When last time I got to Aldi? The last time I did the Aldi vlog was the last time I went to Aldi because Aldi is very far from where we live. So I started going to Tesco. But now that we have a car, I can now start going. I can go back to my Aldi because our Aldi is a lot more affordable. And like varieties in Aldi. I like my Aldi. So I'm going to Aldi today after church to shop for the for the dinner for the week. I'm not going to want. I don't know. But I just shop normally. In Audi today, and I'll take you guys along. Okay, All right, okay, I'll take you guys along. I'll take you guys along. All right, bye bye. Hey, you're not in my, you're not in my subscribers. I am happy Sunday, happy Mother's Day. Hello, Miss Rachel, my my party, my party in Vegas. <laughs> she's my she's shy. She's running away. All of you are always shy with my channel. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Let him go. You want to go back to Aldi? I want to buy something in Aldi. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Can you? You can, Abby. Hey, what's the thing? I mean, do you mind? No problem. People should not, don't get No, 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 no. I just want to buy something Audi. I will not stay tonight, I promise. <laughs> I know you are your husband. No, no, we will not stay tonight. I just want to buy something Audi. <laughs> Maybe let me carry bag upstairs. We need, let me carry that big Smith bag upstairs. So my son has gone down with my friend now. Yay! It's not me and my husband. Already can stress me. Especially when I go to Audi or anywhere to shop. He will now be picking expensive, expensive things. You will not have choice than to buy it for him. Ha! Huh? So I'm even happy we're not going with him today. I'll go by myself. I'm going to carry shopping bag upstairs now. I will go to Aldi. I'll take you guys along. Are you ready? I forgot to put on earring today to church for my rush rush. But I still look fine now. I still look fine. It doesn't matter. And it's not even showing that I'm not wearing earring. I've got to put, put on earring today. Let's go. I'm really excited today. Like they celebrate all mothers. And I was feeling myself. I'm like, ah, I'm a mother. Is it easy? If it's easy, run up. <laughs> God, I beg. I'm sorry. I mean, I don't. It's, it's just for fun. I, I'm sure like if you are watching my video and you are still looking on to God to have a child. I pray that God in his infinite mercy would, you know bestow upon you that blessing of being a mother um it's just amazing honestly it's it's a it's a difficult 
job at the same time it's rewarding it's beautiful you want to run away from doing it at the same time you want to keep doing it you know what i mean sometimes i'm like this child i beg just go and stay somewhere for like one week and immediately he leaves like this i'm already like hey where's my child you know so like you are you are incredible happy mother's day to you i'm sure this video might not even come out like monday or tuesday and i might try my best possible to d release it today but i, I doubt it i highly doubt it because i have like a lot of things to do um i have trainings to do when i get upstairs so I might not have the time to edit it and post it today. But any day you see it, happy Mother's Day to you. You're celebrating, oh, wow. okay? So let's go to Audi. I'll take you guys along. Waiting for you. So we're in Audi, guys. It's time to go in and shop. Let me show you guys Audi. Oil on my head. You guys can see it's Audi time. Two thousand years later. Yeah, so we are done shopping now, guys. I couldn't show you guys everything i bought like as i was buying them on the aisle i, I know you, you guys love, love to see that part but i just didn't have energy to, to do all those things i just bought what i needed to buy and get out when i get to i'll do it all of everything i bought and i'll show you guys and i'll show you guys the price i don't know if he took the receipt did he take the receipt i know everything we spent was like 80 pounds it, 80 something pounds and we like we bought quite a lot that would last us at least three weeks it might not last us a month but some of some of the things will last us a month like the rice now don't worry when i get home i'll show you guys one after the other what we buy what we ah what am i saying what we bought she english what we buy <laughs> what we bought i'll show you guys one by one i'm really tired as you guys now I, I don't know if people will argue but from my own experience now that i've shopped in tesco for a while and i'm shopping in audi audi is not cheaper now nah, audi is not cheaper than tesco i'm sorry some things are expensive in audi that are cheap in tesco some things are expensive in tesco that are cheap in audi so like this this, this supermarkets they all have different different you get what i mean so because today now normally I, I buy there's this i'll show you guys when i get home there's this egg i buy in tesco for one pound fifty something one pound and it just became one pound fifty something because it was one pound twenty something and it was 15 yes 15 eggs for that price now it's 10 because I, I think they said um they're having issues with chickens laying eggs and all that so they reduced it to 10 10 for one pound 40 something or one pound 50 the same this audi they're selling 12 that same egg they're selling 12 of the egg for two pound 25 i'm not sure now but two pound something sha i'll be two pound 14 two pound 40 so two pound something like it's so expensive egg in tesco is cheaper than audi you see an egg is an essential some things are cheaper than each other so i don't think i'll be coming to audi to shop again because it's far from my house even with the driving going it's too far i rather go to tesco that is just at the bus station that is not far from me so i won't be coming to audi again i'm sorry guys for audi people i'm sorry i sign out i'll be buying my things in tesco tesco is closer for me the price is the same thing the reason is even more expensive this day maybe it's the um, cost of living cr crisis because when we came way back six months ago it was cheaper it was relatively cheaper than tesco but now it's not cheaper again all the prices have gone up so i will not be stressing myself to come again my mom was just laughing at me audi woman oh yeah buy now you're shouting audi audi is the best audi woman oh yeah buy audi woman buy I, I was feeling bad ah this man has seen me finish he has seen me finish oh, so <laughs> i'm not coming to audi. so we are home now guys we are home and i'll do the all for you quickly very quickly i think it's too high i put it high up to my head hey oh, oh, oh yes let me show you guys my flower i got flowers for mother's day i don't know if you guys can see sorry guys let me let me go back oh god i got flowers I, focus now ah the exposure i don't know i got flowers for mother's day my husband bought me flowers yesterday oh god i'm so sorry the camera is doing on this it's all funny on your own i got flowers for mother's day yesterday night he gave it to me yesterday night and i just put it See, as you guys can see, I don't have a, a, a vase, so I now put it in my blender, whatever. See, <laughs> don't laugh at me, oh. So I put the flower in my blender um, container. See, that's, I, that's where I put the flower because I don't have a vase because I need it to bloom. It's fresh flowers. So what I'm doing, I'll have to look for like a proper flower vase because I, I really love flowers. Although I've not bought any flowers since I got here. Oh. But this is like the first flower I'm getting, first fresh fresh flower I'm getting since I got here. So I'll look for a vase in like a charity store because the ones I'm seeing on Amazon, I don't understand why it's that expensive. So I'll check for charity stores, but about £2, £3, I'll get a really nice vase and I'll put it up there for my flowers. 
So let's get down to the all, all now, shall we? The total of the things we bought. I'll first put everything on the table like I always do so you guys can see, you guys can know. <sighs> cost of living crisis, like cost of living as a reason. It's not only, it's every part of the world they're experiencing inflation. Most of the things that I bought today, before when I, like about six, four, five, five, six months ago when we first came, when I went to, when I always go to Audi, it's not usually this expensive. Most of them are like one pound higher, 50 pence, it's just crazy. So I'll show you guys very quickly what I bought today and you guys will be the judge and see if it's like expensive or it's better. But I feel like, like I said in the car, I already said this before, Audi is not cheaper than Tesco. They are all now the same because cost of living has balanced all of them out. The rise in cost of living, sorry, has balanced all of them out. So before, without further ado, let me show you guys everything I got. Let me lower this camera so you guys can see the table. This is the first bag. I have like three big bags of what we got. So I'll start from this bag. Like you guys know, this is the Berry Blast coin for my son. It's always in Aldi. You can't find this in Tesco. It's very cheap. I think it's about, I think one pound something. I don't, I'm not sure. Let me put it down. Then this egg, this is the egg I was telling you guys in the car. Now this egg in Audi, I must look for the price because it was ridiculously expensive. It's 12, 12 inside. I'm coming on. The price, I'm like, ah, because the one I buy in Tesco, make I find egg, quick, quick, quick. Don't let me waste you guys time. I'm coming on. Egg, eh, eggs, 12 in a pack, two pounds 49. And Yarale, how will I buy this egg? Sorry. This egg, two pounds forty-nine. It's just too expensive. And this is the one I always buy in Tesco for one pound forty. Now this is one that we have at home that is almost finished. It's just three inside. This one is ten. This one is the Tesco own. It's ten inside for one pound twenty something. I'm not sure. This is two pound forty-nine. Twelve ten. So this one is very cheap and it's Tesco. Tesco that we to say is expensive. So how do we go have some things that are expensive? So we bought the eggs. Um, next thing we got, of course, is pastas. Now these pastas are twenty three p. They are very affordable, twenty three p. And I bought from the essentials range, uh, from the Audi range. Like I said in my first Audi vlog, if you are shopping in all this, if you are very new in Swansea or, and you are just shopping, make sure you buy things that are made by the stores. Now, if you guys, if you guys look here now, you see, focus, 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 focus. You guys, you see Audi here. Now it means that Audi produce this spaghetti so it's cheaper so if you go to tesco to try to buy things that tesco produced is cheaper so i got this one i got three three should be enough for us for the month we have one more and that that should be enough but you don't eat pasta like that but i don't know for some reason mama doesn't really really like spaghetti so i just make it days that i'm tired i just come back from work i don't have energy i'll just put it I, if I have still just make white spaghetti and people eat, people will be alright. I can't kill myself. So those are the days I buy it for. So this is bacon. Now, I've never tried bacon before. Never. My husband ate it from my... My went to my neighbor's place yesterday and he ate it and he said it was really, really good. So he wanted us to try it. I just bought this one. I didn't buy plenty. So in case I don't like it. It's pork. It's just pork. So if you're able to fry pork, I just put it in the air fryer. I'll show you guys the air fryer. It was good, guys. Hey! Oh, wow. I don't know. I already have one clip, but I'll show you guys and I'll show you guys how I got the deal. Wait for it. You see, this is why you should wait for it. Wait, watch the end of this video so you guys can hear that deal. So I bought the bacon. My husband likes digestive biscuits for one for himself. Now, this is tomato paste. For you guys that are coming from Nigeria, you don't have to bring tomato paste from Nigeria, but I didn't know that. I brought like a pack, a carton of um, derika. Let me show you guys. I'm coming. I don't know if you guys understand what I mean. Yeah, I bought a carton of this tomato paste. I bought it from Nigeria and it's finished now. Six months. That's tried. It's just two, I think it's just two days that rain or three. So I have to buy. I know that I'll be needing more for the month. So I, this is the one they have in Audi. This one. I have a friend that uses this one and she says it's very good. She's like, she has told me a, a lot about it that it tastes good. It's natural tomato. This one is not tomato. This is not what this thing. Nigeria, they, there's nobody doing quality check, quality control, so they might have mixed chemical or whatever. But this one is like, she said it's pure tomato and it makes her food red and it's nice. So I bought, um, how many did I buy? I bought five. I'm sure five, but it's too much. 
and these ones are very very cheap like extremely i think they are 23 pence or so they are very affordable i bought five of these don't let me let me show you five of that i bought greek yogurt i'm always buying yogurt now let, let me tell you how i take my yogurt i like to take my yogurt with fruits i don't know this is getting dark I like to take my yogurt with fruit, so when I don't take it, I just dice in apples inside and maybe grapes if I have. But I don't have grapes, most of the time I don't use apples, just pour apple inside and I enjoy my yogurt. So I bought one Greek yogurt. It was bigger, see, cost of living crisis again. It was bigger than it for before. This Greek yogurt, it was like the container was as long as this. This is the one I buy in Tesco. See, the container, this is the Tesco one. I still have very small from. Let's go on. See this one now is still is long. This is how it this one was before. Now they've cut it down to this size. So Aldi is not all that are big. Aldi the cost of living affects in UK. If you don't understand Yoruba, I can't translate it. So I'm going to return this. Yeah. So I bought that. I bought these chips. Now I don't like the tiny tiny chips. If you guys know. Those tiny, tiny street cut chips, I don't like them. I prefer the fat ones. So this one is the fat one. And the, so if you guys get to Aldi, they also sell it in Tesco. So just look for it. Four, four seasons stick cut chips. It's like fat. It's, when you fry it and you eat one, you know you're eating chips. Like it's proper potato chips. That's it. Ah, you're about oh my queen, you're about to be full. You know that you eat your eating. Those tiny, tiny ones, I don't know. I don't like this one. So I like to buy this one. This one can substitute for yam. I can make yam and I can use this one to make potato and egg. You know, it doesn't just have to be chicken and chips because it's fat, right? So that's done. Then I bought tomatoes. If you guys don't know, tomatoes have been scarce in UK because they said them. Um, I don't know the because they import tomatoes into the UK, guys. Can you believe that they import tomatoes into the UK? So because I don't know, I said I think they. Country that is importing it is having problem or they having farming or whatever. They've not been able to import a lot of tomatoes like they will before. So like tomato um, supply is a little bit low, and they said by April May it will be back to normal. So I was able to buy five of these, and I'm very happy about that. I was able to buy five of these tomato for still. I'm sorry, this will not be. I still have like three of these in the whatever anyway in the fridge. So I know that this will last us like. Give or take two weeks, I will buy tomatoes again. The then I bought onions, of course, onions, rice. I always buy this easy cook rice. If you are shopping from Aldi, this one is like the closest to our Nigerian rice. This long grain rice, I always buy the Tesco one as well. But when I go to Aldi, just look for anything that they say long grain rice, the normal rice. You know, buy it. Mm, yes, this one is for my shawarma. I always use this thing for my shawarma. It's nice. I bought one. Madam bought one when we couldn't get this one. It was burger sauce. Well, it was yuck. It wasn't all that. In fact, it was one that said we have to look for this one again. This is the one he bought. Burger sauce, as you guys can see. It didn't taste well in our shawarma. It didn't taste. It didn't give us that. It was not giving us that taste. For this one, if you want to make shawarma burger in the UK. Just go to Aldi or Tesco, they sell these ends. Ends is the best. Ends saucy sauce. Amazing. It tastes really, really good for burger, sharam and everything. Don't say I did not, don't say I did not plug you. I plugged you. Okay? Right, so, I have to move the camera up so it'll be quick. Then my blush bread, like I told you, sweetest bread in the UK. I'll give it to you. I don't know. I'll give it to anybody who wants to do it. And I bought this very big, massive chicken now the one i used to buy before was two pounds 29 and it was 12 inside now we went there today now it has reduced to 10 and it's now two pounds 49 so it's higher so my husband found this one that is i don't know how many is this i said i don't even know but it's a lot inside it's a lot more than that for three pounds 10. so this one is a better deal so if you shop it out you look for this bigger fuller drumstick is a better deal guys it's a better deal then I bought chicken wings because I'm tired of this drumstick. If you can, if you know, I'm tired. That's why I have to get the air fryer because I'm tired of grilling chicken. Every day, grill, grill. Grilling chicken, oh, to sue me. Like, I'm tired. Now, when I eat grilled chicken, I, I, I put it on my food and I don't eat it because I'm tired. Let me speak to you about oh, almost me. I'm, I'm done. So I have to, like, buy air fryer so that I'll be frying the chicken instead. You know, grilled chicken is different from fried chicken. When you fry chicken, it's, like, dried, it's sweeter. So I just want to try another another type of chicken. So this is chicken wings. 
I got chicken wings as well. It's not up to two pounds, but one pound something. And it's about 15 inside. It's one kg, one kilo. Right, so another onion. Yay, I'm so happy about this purchase. You guys don't know, you have no idea. This spray bottle, this olive oil, I don't know if you guys can see. Olive oil spray bottle. Like if you want to fry egg, I've been looking for, I wanted to buy the normal fancy ones on Amazon. Like there's some of them on Amazon that's fancy, it's like the bottle is very fine and you just spray it on your fry pan, you fry your egg. But I don't know, for one reason or the other, you know me now, Mrs. Budget, I don't like stress, I don't like spending money anyhow. So I've just been, eight pounds, I'm like, I hate eight pounds just to buy what I'll put or oil inside. I beg, this one. Yes, I, I know it's plastic, but it's going to do the job. It doesn't have everything doesn't have to be fine and sparkly. It's going to do the job, so I don't care. So this one, um, I got it for one pound something. It's very very affordable. I'll check the price. One pound, shall one pound fifty or one pound something. And there's oil inside though. There's olive oil inside that I'll start spraying with first. And I'll start using to cook first before I now put my own on it. So all I have to do is just open this nozzle and spray my fry pan, put my egg on it. I fried my egg, I fried my bacon, I fried anything I want to fry without too much oil. So I have a spray bottle and oil together for one pound something. Hey, Amazon will kiss somebody with big money. I bought honey. My my son uses honey for everything. He wants to take tea, he wants to take his oats, he wants to take his cereal, he always uses honey. So I had to buy this honey. This honey was about 20, 30 something pence. So now, 75 pence. Make my own vex. I'm just, all this money is vexing me because I like budgeting. <laughs> so we have mackerel. Like I told you guys, in the last Audi vlog I did, I told you guys, this size, this mackerel is the best. Sardines, I buy sardines too as well. I like using sardines for my jello fries. Just to give it that fish smell. I like the sardine taste or the smell it gives to my food. So I like to put sardine in my jello fries or my pasta. But if I want to really make like mackerel stew for yam and all, I like to use proper, proper mackerel. I'm not sure if you guys can see it. Okay, yeah, fish monger is very, very good. So I like to buy mackerel instead of sardine for those things. And I bought this gigantic sashay because I want to make um what's it called I want to make jello fries this afternoon so I bought this very big big massive tatashe and I bought two so I'll use it to make jello fries I want pack of apple right one bag is done let me bring the second bag the second bag is up here guys as you guys can see this is fruit split Jesus I would have put this in the fridge since so ew it's already melting no? I'll put it back in the fridge it's like popsicles it's fruit split I bought it for myself but not even for my son let me put this in the fridge guys I'm coming breaking transmission I put it in the freezer so it's already, it's already melting so this is the second patache I told you about so I'll use the two of them for jello fries today I'm making quite a lot you know try to cook in bulk especially if you are working try to don't just make rice that you eat in one day make rice that you can eat twice I be if I make it today today is Sunday afternoon if I make rice and whatever today we can eat it this this afternoon eat it in the night again then I'll keep the rest in the fridge maybe for like next tomorrow you know just going to help you don't be cooking small small food because I don't have energy yeah this biscuit bourbon I love it so much so I have to buy two my tangerine you guys know I'm always buying this thing I love them so much in Aldi I think 90 pence or whatever is in Tesco is about 99 pence. So that's the difference. But, so this is the pepper. Then my tomatoes. I have more from that. Yes, another thing I want to show you guys from Aldi. Now this is one of the reasons why I know that okay, Tesco cannot beat Aldi. Because Aldi sells like affordable home things. Now this is like your liquid soap to wash clothes. The one I buy from let, let me show you Tesco own. This is the one from Tesco, as you guys can see, Tesco. This one is three pounds something, three pounds fifty or so. It's quite expensive. It's close to four pounds. While this, this is one pound twenty. It's liquid. It's the same thing. You know? This is how like Tesco will put their own in small small sachet like this. Can you see? Then I have like this liquid now. Let's say it's now poured into this. So there's no difference. So all I have to do is just pour it in the side of the washing machine and I start washing. When I saw the deal, I'm like, ah, £1.20. So I had to buy two. I bought this coconut crush one and I bought this lavender and jasmine. So I know that these two should be enough for the month. What am I washing? I did not just give birth to newborn baby. 
so I don't need I don't need to wash so much. Yeah, the carrots, 50 pence. I remember this one, very affordable. My husband, shortbread. I don't know if you if you're a shortbread lover, comment below. My husband can eat shortbread in his dream. He loves shortbread. So he, he bought it. Now this and another reason why Tesco has not beaten out the year. This is shaving stick for my husband. And that reason why this thing has not this uh, what's it called? They sell vitamin C gummies. Now this one is vitamin B3 because we don't have sun in the UK. Like we've not had sun for a while. Now we are going to summer sun. This is spring. This is March. It's spring. The flowers are already blooming. You can see that spring. Spring is here. So thank God the cold is reducing and then sun will be out a lot more than winter. So you need vitamin D3. You need vitamin D. Like please get a supplement that is vitamin D because it's going to help you without like what the sun gives your body in nigeria this vitamin d will give back to you you get what i mean so try to get a vitamin c multivitamin so i bought one of each for my husband and i a pack of pepper as you can see green pepper for fried rice and all that this bag is done i have a smaller bag of course oil vegetable oil like i showed you in the formal video vegetable oil is cheaper than sunflower oil so you can get vegetable oil and it's pure vegetable oil here, yeah, so I'm not scared of that. Ooh, I, this is yogurt for my husband. He likes this yogurt a lot. This vanilla yogurt, and he only gets it at Aldi. It is one reason he was shouting, yeah, let's go, let's go, because he knows he's going to buy his yogurt, he's going to buy a shortbread, whatever. <laughs> whatever, man. We can. So, yes. <laughs> Baking powder, another gummy. This is like normal multivitamin. 60 so you're supposed to take two a day so 60 is inside one in the morning one in the night is daily multivitamin you can only get this at aldi tesco does not sell anything like this and it's very affordable in aldi like can you cup pens not even up to a pound so it's necessary then baking paper before i used to use foil like i told you guys in one of my videos if you're like an og subscriber you know this from me i've told you guys to stop using foil when you want to fry in the air fryer i want to bake in your oven please stop using foil use a baking paper let me show you if you don't know what the baking paper looks like i'll show you because i know that me too i didn't know what the baking paper was until when i got here and when my friend told me not to like told me to stop using foil and use baking paper i did not know so i know that some people will be here that don't know so don't feel like you are a village gay hold on let me show you so this is what the baking paper is this is the tesco this is the one i have almost finished so it's like this it's the baking paper so this is better for your for your baking it's better for your grilling in the oven than what's it called now than foil of course you only know what foil is i don't have to show you what foil is but you get you don't know too let me show you this is what foil is this one is not good cool. just you can just use it to wrap your shawarma when you are done don't wrap your shawarma with it or wrap your sandwich with it don't ever use it to cook don't eat it up it's, it's bad it's can serious don't use foil use baking paper catch you go have you guys heard me yeah so i'll, I'll show you every other thing granulated sugar from aldi what else what else right so i bought this dish this one now like i told you before this not I, i've not tried this one so i can't tell of the authenticity but i'll show you this one I'll show you this one guys. See this one? This fairy, they don't pay me for advert, they should come and pay me. This fairy is like the best I've ever used in this UK. I'm telling you, it lasts for a long time. It's expensive. It's three pounds. This concolor thing you can see is three pounds. But you will use it for like a month plus. It does not like you all you need is tiny and it foams a lot. And then so it gives you value for your money. Imagine I just buy this one for a whole month plus three pounds to wash your plates. It makes a lot of sense. This one now, on the other hand, is never up to one pound. It's like it's it, it's five p. As you can see, it's very, it's very watery. But I I couldn't find fairy in Aldi. I wanted to buy fairy. I couldn't find. So I just bought this one. That okay, Magnum. Let me try. It can a, a, a exceed my expectation and it can whatever. But let me just try and have it as backup when this one finishes. Cause I don't want to go back to that Aldi this month. I don't want to buy something like this again this month. But after I'll just buy one bag thing. Maybe tomato or whatever to restock so i had to buy this one i don't know about it but this is fairy anywhere you see it and you're in the uk buy it it's perfect it's expensive but it does the job right i hope i'll be able to convince you not to confuse you <laughs> 
so um, what else? This I still have more of this. I bought two because I don't want it to finish. Ah, it's perfect for your shawarma, guys. You guys will thank me later. It's perfect for your shawarma. Then roll on. Roll on. They about seventy five pence each. This is for as you can see. Pink for mommy. Black for daddy. <laughs> what else? What else? That's it. Every other thing you guys have seen. I just have like mackerel. Nothing else. It's all finished. And I just bought one pack of coke. I just bought one pack of coke and it's for the month, it's 24 inside. Now I don't know how much it is. Let me check that paper. I'm coming. I just bought the pack of coke, it's 24 inside, and that's it. That's that's our shopping for the month. That's done. As you guys can see, it's not as it's not as the last um, Audi vlog I did, like we had like bought so many things because that was the first time we were ever shopping that big. But now that we've been living for a, 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 a while in the UK, we have some things still in stock that we don't need to buy, so it's like less. And everything we bought today now is about 80 something pounds. Let me get the paper and I'll show you guys, okay? I'm coming. So I found the paper and as you guys can see, look at it. Focus, camera, focus, camera, focus. <laughs> it's not focusing, whatever, man. That's the list, as you guys can see. So the total we have is 86 pounds, 23 pence. 86 pounds, 23 pence. So now I won't be going to Aldi to shop again like I told you. Why? Because the things are now the same price as Tesco, so there's no difference. In fact, the egg was more... That egg is vexing me, so let me rant. Because the price I used to buy this one egg, I used to buy two, two parts of egg in Tesco. So let me rant. <laughs> so, but every other thing is like very, very similar. So there's no, like, the margin is not, it's like, there's no even margin safe. But there's no point. Only if you prefer Audi or if you live close to Audi, that's when, okay, you can say, okay. But because I, I, I don't live close to Audi, I have to drive a long place. I would just rather go to Tesco that is close to me and shop all my things from them. So what else? I wanted to show you the price of the Coca-Cola. Yes. Oh my God. Coca-Cola is expensive. Oh. If I knew, I wouldn't have bought it to guess. 13 pounds. They had 10 pounds. I wouldn't have bought it. The Ijebu Yumi wouldn't have bought it. I would have bought the 12 pieces food. What am I using 24 pieces of calculator to do? As they be eating sugar, sugar now. Sugar is not good for the system. Hey! 13 pounds. Hey! Don't worry. No problem. I'm oh, not vexed. There's no problem. There's no problem. So that's it for now, guys. Yes, I was going to show you guys the air fryer I got. Now, this air fryer is an amazing deal. When you want to buy stuff, go to... Um, Facebook market, especially if you just see, I'm not talking to OGs of UK. If you've been here for like a long time, I'm sure all this price I'm saying will be like, what is, How much is 13 pounds? How much is this money? Because you've made a lot of money in the UK, you've worked for a while. If you work in the UK for one year, I think the reason why you can't buy cook of 13 pounds is affordable, you have saved enough. But newcomers like us is what I'm talking to. Newcomers, come forward, come forward. Let me show you people's things. Let me plug you. Now, as you guys can see, let me lower, as you guys can already see the air fryer, let me lower the camera. Let me lower the camera. Shape people have seen like this, have you? Hmm. I'm sure you guys can see the air fryer better like this, okay? Right, so let me take all these jabajantis away from the front of it. So it doesn't cover the beauty of my air fryer. So I'll bring this forward now. Can you guys see? Let me lower this more so you guys can see very well. Yes, so that's it. Now, see this air fryer. I got it from Facebook Market for guests. Drum roll. 20 pounds yes 20 pounds i know that some people get stuff from facebook market even cheaper i know some people get something from things from facebook market even cheaper um because and some people may get it for free so many people give things out on facebook market for free but this fri is like it's brand new the woman bought it and she got married and I think uh she was explaining everything to me like you know they like explaining things here she said she got married and her husband has kids too so she has a bigger family now and so this air fryer is too small for her in her own words so that's why she sold it to me now look at it the air fryer is it has very good space inside it's very clean because she bought it very new very very clean and the 
product is tower she posted it for 40 pounds but i priced it and bargained and bargained i kept telling her ah i just came into the uk i'm a student so she just pity me i beg i just need a fire for my family of three that we are just husband wife and one child that she should please so she now finally sold it to me for that 20 pounds now what is my advice i'm coming fryer for 20 pounds guys you guys will not believe it 20 pounds and it's working perfectly i've fried a lot of things inside that it came out crispy good so if you if you just came and you're trying to like cut down on too much spending and you want to just shop on a budget this is just going off my head me. and you want to shop on a budget sorry guys sorry guys I you want to shop on a budget, go to Facebook Market. There are chairs on Facebook Market. So people have been giving, out, giving it out for free. There are chairs, there are wardrobes, there are just to start out your life. Before you now get the job, start working, save your money, then you can dash those things out and buy crispy, clean things for yourself. Like I said, this house now that we live, I've not done it to my taste yet because it's not our permanent house. It's just Swansea University accommodation that they give to us. So by September now, we have to vacate this house. So by, by the time we start... By the time we get our own proper space by September, then you will now see my taste. You have not seen me finish. I'm coming. <laughs> so that's when I'll like buy my own furniture, buy my own type of chairs, buy my own type of everything that I like. This house is really lovely. I love it. It's been serving us well. But I'm like, I can't really design to my spec because I have to leave everything I met there. The university has put everything there. We became furnished. So I have to use everything the university has given us, right? So, right. If you want to get things and you got your own place, you are not, you know, you, you, didn't get um, university accommodation and you're in Swansea or anywhere in the UK, check Facebook markets, guys. They have good deals. This brand new air fryer, I checked it on Corey's website. It was £98 and it was even on sale. So even if it's not on sale, it's like about 100 and something. So, and I got it for £20, this same exact air fryer. So, I'm telling you guys, Ninja is about £200, £180. It's quite expensive. So if you are trying to like cut your prices, cut your spendings, Facebook market is the place for you to go. I'm sure you've heard this on different people's channel, but I'm telling you again now that it's a good place to go. And like I said, this food that we got now, everything, look at how big it is, for it's something pounds. And the cost of living has risen in the UK. It wasn't like this before. Before I'll buy it in like 60 pounds or 60 something pounds. Even at that, it's not bad. So if you are thinking of coming to the UK this year, 2023, please, and they are telling you, oh, UK, UK has casted, everybody's in UK, Nigerians in the UK. I'll not be looking at them on Instagram when everybody will be typing, all oh, the Nigerians are moved to UK, everybody's in UK. Don't mind them. Everybody's in UK. Why are they going there? Because it's a good country. Imagine you're eating 8 something pounds to buy food that you're going to eat for like a month or three weeks. And you're earning that something pounds in. Let's say you're even working minimum wage. Not everybody works minimum wage here. Let's say you're working minimum wage and earning 10 pounds per hour. Of which they're even increasing the minimum wage in April to 10 pounds 42 pence. Minimum wage. If you're above 23, once you're 23 and above, you'll be earning 10 pounds 42 pence for the least job. Cleaner, security, that's the least your company can pay you. You earn this at something pounds in 8 hours. In a day, so the money you're earning in a day can feed you for a month. That's not bad. Like it's a good country. I'm telling you, if anybody's telling you that UK has casted all, all we pay is tax. That's a lie. Fine, we pay taxes, we pay bills, but you are seeing what the tax is doing for you. You go on the road, there's no one single pothole. There's no one. If they see one single pothole, they will fix it. And you call the attention to it, they are fixing it immediately. Like I showed you guys in one of my vlogs. They fix their roads like there's no tomorrow. There's no one single pothole. There's law and order. Nobody's killing anybody. Fine, there are cycles. No, no country is free from criminals. There are criminals everywhere. But I'm telling you for real, for real, this country is good. It is very good if you want to come. Don't let anybody discourage you. Try and find the money and come. It's a great place to live. All my friends, if I have my enemies, I advise them to leave Nigeria now. Chief, is all this political nonsense that Lagos states, nobody else elects to know who they put on there. Nobody else elects to know who they put on there. Nobody else elects uh, Desmond Deliot to put on there. I don't see any house you like. So I don't know. Nigeria is a great place. If it's favoring you now, very good for you. I'm happy for you. If you like it, there is good. I love my country. I love it so much. It's a fun place. It's, everybody's happy in Nigeria. It's good. It's home. UK can, like, it's not home. It cannot be like Nigeria. But I can make it. Home is where 
you live with your family and you have peace that's where it's home if you don't have to live in your own country to say you're at home i'm home now because i have peace of mind i'm living with my family here my husband is here my son is here and we are flourishing by god's grace you know it's not as if we are there we have no landed but we are sure eating if you are able to eat and wear clothes the rest is secondary eat wear clothes have roof by your head the remaining things secondary get what i mean so i'm just encouraging you if you really want to come to the uk do it that's what i'm going to say do it but do it informed do it informed read there are so many articles now so many what's it called youtube videos now littered everywhere about the uk look at i've just done video of shopping in audi how much food is and everything that's and if that's information try to watch these videos and get information so you can make informed decisions right and i'll see you guys in my next video thank you guys for watching so far like comment subscribe share Happy Mother's Day to you once again. You rock. And I love every mother out there. I'm not saying shout out to men. I'm shouting out, shout out to mothers today. Because it's Mother's Day. I'll see you guys in my next video guys. Thank you for always loving me and sticking with me. I love you too. And stay blessed. Bye bye. Mwah. I said this is a spray guys. The spray light olive oil. So I'm going to open the cap now. As you guys can see. And I'll spray. I want to put my, so I'm not trying to spray so that I'm supposed to give me oil, so I don't know why, whatever. So I think that's, that's the olive oil, so I'm going to spray it around so that the chicken will not stick to the pan, right, to the whatever. So yes, so this is my chicken here, it's already been boiled, I'll just transfer from here, put it in here and I'll show you guys the result when it's done frying. So you guys should check out for this if you don't want to use, you know, when you want to fry egg, stuff and you just need oil i'm so happy for this purchase like and i got it for just one pound something like very rough. okay see it's it's an audi product see this is why i say you should always buy things that is made by the company because it's audi now that's why it's cheap it's it's not even cheap sorry that's why it's affordable that's why it's affordable not cheap when it's cheap it means it's not good like the product is not quality that's when you call it cheap so you call it affordable when the product is quality but it's a very good price so it is affordable <laughs> so you guys should check out for these guys like i'm really happy about it i'll show you that's all put here boiled now all i have to do is transfer it here oh wow that one is too high sorry so as you guys can see it's how crispy like proper crispy and this is how i like my chicken i like it very very dried fried so I'll turn it now. Some parts are still not fried. So I'll turn it upside down now and put it back in. And by the time it's out, you have your fried chicken. So that's how to use the air fryer. So if you don't know, try to get an air fryer. It will, it will help you eat more healthy and with less oil. You'll be cooking with less roux. If you, that's why I'm doing this demo video to show people that don't know. So you know how to use an air fryer. So you can decide if you really need one or not. But I think it's a really good buy because you won't be using too much oil. It will save you frying in deep oil. I hate frying in deep oil. Like it's be splashing everywhere. Try to get an air fryer. It makes sense. Once it's fried now, I'll show you. Then you can see yourself that it makes so much sense. My makeup is smudged. It and everything I've been cooking for a while here. Yeah. So I'm going to clean it up and let me show you guys the purpose. Now the lot is ready. As you guys can see, it's still steaming. And chicken has been... As I make pepper chicken like it's crispy fried now and so i just mix it with pepper sauce oh god thank you jesus for food looks yummy yummy yummy